So, hey, everybody, it is uh, Kent Clothier. Welcome to the interview I'm doing here today. I'm trying to do a series of these over the course of the next few weeks, talking to um, guys that I, and girls that I have a ton of respect for, people that I've worked with personally, people that have uh, been very successful with our systems, we've had the, you know a lot of uh, interaction with, and quite frankly, people that have um, become really good friends of mine. So, I've got on the call here today a very special friend, a guy by the name of Dan Walters. What's happening, brother? What's, What's up, my friend? How are you? Doing good, man. Thanks for doing this. Absolutely. So um, let's. I, I just, for the sake of time here, I want to let me bring up my questions. I want to go through and try to help people um, understand the power of really, you know, what's possible, right? So that's kind of the that's kind of the gist of what what this uh, interview is all about. Um, I think people, and I know you've kind of experienced the same thing, but I think people get locked into this belief system that uh, this is a lot more difficult than it really needs to be, and that ends up hurting them more than helping them. Do you agree with that? Absolutely. Yeah, we're all uh, we're all victims of getting in our own way for sure. No doubt. And so um, I'm going to give you like two seconds or two minutes here to talk about a little bit about your business, guys. So so by way of introduction, Dan and I. Um, work together on, uh, we still work together at this very, at this moment, uh, Dan is a consulting client of mine that I work with personally, one-on-one, -on -one, mentoring him and his business. He has uh, been with me now for several months, uh, but he was successful before he ever came to me. He had been doing this for a number of years, he's up in Idaho, he's got a very successful business, and we've been able to work together and kind of help him kind of take it in a little bit different direction and kind of experience some New a new level of success, if you will, kind of redefine some things and get things going in a completely different direction. So, with that, dude, kind of tell everybody if you don't mind a little bit about your business. Sure. Yeah, my uh, my business is more of a. Uh, I come from a, a buy and hold strategy. I, I primarily focus on single family residents um, here in the uh, here in the, the Treasure Valley in the Boise area, Boise Nampa area. Um, you know, prior to you know coming to you, and that's really what I did. I I, I go out and buy single family residents uh, uh, on a on a buy and hold basis. Um, done some few flips here and there, but primarily that's that was my that was my core focus. And and uh, and, and your really do. and your situation was, and again, dude, I don't you know. Let, let me just ask the question directly. So you came and you and I got introduced, kind of over. Uh, by, by you coming through one of our systems, correct? Which system was it that you purchased first? Actually, I, I hadn't even bought any of your systems. What I, what I came, I came across you on, off of uh, just off of an email on, on for a webinar. Um, it was right around the first of the year, talking about setting goals and getting um, for your business. And I was just transitioning out of a partnership and really going on my own for the first time in probably five, six, seven years. So for me, it, it seemed like a perfect time to. To look into that transition and, and help look, look for somebody that could help me um, help help me grow and help me get on the path that I needed to for to succeed the way that, that, that I envisioned. So it was really through a webinar that right. I was introduced to you. Cool. Um, and then as you came in, talk to us a little bit if you don't mind. I, I really want people to understand the value of you know, kind of trusting the systems, work, you know, you and I working together, kind of that whole process, you know, and I don't want to put words in your mouth. I want you to kind of talk a little bit about it and what that experience was like all the way around. Sure. You know, at first, uh, for me, it, it was, you know, it, it was, it, it was a big leap of faith for me to step into something like this. I mean, not, not only from a financial commitment, but, uh, I mean, just from the, from the emotional, psychological aspects of it as well, because again, transitioning, out of a partnership where you're relying on somebody else for 50% of the workload and what and what you do, um, and then now where I was taking on 100% of all the responsibility and 100% of the liability of, of all the decisions, it was a pretty daunting task to me. So I knew I had to make a, a huge mental and psychological shift to really get myself on the path that I needed to succeed. And so with that, it, you know, there was a lot of hurdles that I had to overcome in my own way, as you well know, you and I over our you know, over our, our time together, we had, I wouldn't say butting heads, but it was basically me resisting you uh, pushing me to where I needed to get to and me pushing back because you know, it was out of my comfort zone. Um, so that, but from that process, that's, you know, really, it was, uh, 
it was a challenge for me. But at the same time, looking back on it now, the, the, those pains of growing, getting out of my own way, and, and really trusting in and believing in what we're doing and, and what you know, the systems you provide and the systems that you teach, you know, trusting in what you're doing and, 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 just, and just repeating and continually working at it, and you will see results. And it's, it, it's, a, it's really comes down to, at the end of the day, really having the faith and really having belief in what you're doing and, and getting after it. And that's once you commit and trust it, you know, the results will happen. Yeah, so I, um, would you say that that was probably the most painful part of this, is just kind of going, getting through, I mean, you know, it is what it is, right? I mean, but Yeah. Yeah, absolutely. You know, it was. Uh, I mean, I, I specifically remember one call that we were on, and it was, we were talking about some, some different marketing things that, that I was doing, um, and I was frustrated and basically frazzled out because I was – Know, throwing out, doing all these different things, and you know, and, and one of the things that you said is, or actually one of the comments that I made was, I feel like I'm just throwing money out the door and I'm not getting any results. And your and your exact words were, well, it's because you are, you know, and so really you need to, you know, that was the, that was the point where you really reined me back in, and it really took me, you know, I had to take a serious look at what I was doing, and it forced me to focus on and stay specific and stay focused on on, on the smaller increments of. Of, of some of the marketing things that I was doing, and gradually build from there as as the results were continuing to flow in. So, so yeah, it was. Uh, what's what's the big aha, dude? What's the big? You know, we've been together now for several months. Um, we've, we've actually become you know good friends. We're talking on a regular basis at this point. What's uh, what's been the big aha in this whole process? Because everybody's different, right? People, you know, you get people that come in and they and they've done a lot of business like you, and then you get people that have come in and they've done nothing. Um, and you get people, you know, I, my, my approach is probably a little different than most. It's because I look at it strictly as a, I, I, I'm here to build a business. I'm here to design a life. I'm here to, you know, create and capture moments, not, not go off and chase money. And so the, the whole concepts are a, a little bit different, a little overarching. So what do you feel like has been the biggest aha for you? If you had to nail it, if you had to put it into, into words. I think there's... Yeah, I, I think there's really been two for me. Um, number one, on which is, you know, it, it was the four questions that we went through. It was the why. You know, the, 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 the real why are, you know, what it is that we're doing, why we're doing it. Um, and one of the things that, you know, it really forced me to look at, you know, look, we all, we all want to be successful. We all, we all want to work. But why, why, do, why do we want to get there? I mean, why do we want to have, why do we do what we do? Well, it's to... For a lot of people, and probably for most, it's, it's to have that freedom to do the things with your family or, you know, for the most part, and provide a lifestyle that, that we all, all dream about. And, you know, that was a big thing for me. And But to do that, it was about removing yourself from your business. And one of the quotes, like you always say, is, you know, find a way to fire yourself as, as quickly as possible from, from these mundane tasks. So it gives you the freedom to do what you want to do. And that... Because at, and I think we're all guilty of this in every way. Whatever task it is, we think we can do it better than somebody else, especially when it's in our own business. And so we tend to get bogged down by all the yeah. minutia, all the mundane stuff. And really, I, I think allowing myself to step away from the business and trust and, and leverage other people, leverage other systems that help you know, do the work for me and still get the same results, if not better results. And then on top of that, have all of that all that much more time to be able to go out and, and do the things that, that we want to do. That was the one big thing, is getting myself out of the business and working working more on it. Um, the, the second one for me is the big aha was just about really knowing, your, from the marketing standpoint, really knowing your numbers. I mean, we, we talk about it a lot, is you know, every, every deal that, we, you know, that, that, that I've done, we talk about it, it's like, well, how much did you spend? You know, where, where did you get this list from? What's your cost per lead? I mean, just down to those minute details. And really, when, when I look at that now, and I, I'm looking at doing a marketing campaign, I, I break it down to those, to those minute numbers. And, and like, I mean, the results are, it just makes more sense. Like you say, well, how, how can I find more ways? To, I mean, I can't throw enough money at, at now because the numbers are, I mean, they're down to a detail. And it, it makes it so much more easier to digest. Totally, man. So, what does your business um, look like today? I mean, this is a, probably a, a, a good update for me right now. I mean, let me back up. And before I ask you that, hold that answer. 
because I want to share this because I thought it was uh, – I, I can remember I was in Austin, Texas. I was at a mastermind, and you and I were on the phone together, and um, you had pushed back on me uh, like the week before, I believe, basically telling me that I was completely full of shit and that uh, the <laughs> – <laughs> I'm just kidding. That the realtors were not responding to you, right? I mean, it's like, dude, these guys, everybody, everybody I talk to, these realtors that are all they, they all think I'm crazy, they all think I'm full of it, blah 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 blah. And then all of a sudden, um, when you kind of shifted, I remember this very I mean, I can remember this phone call, and all of a sudden you were excited and called me like, dude, I got some people that are now responding to me on the realtor side, right? I got I got they stonewalled me for weeks, and now all of a sudden people are responding to me. And now, I don't want to put words in your mouth, but I believe you got some people that are, you know, busting their, their asses for you, and out there really making it happen, right? Absolutely, yeah. And, you know, it, again, it's it, it was it was about positioning, and like you know, like, like we talk about um, positioning yourself, and it's not so much about the content and what you say, but it's the, it's the context and how you say it. And once I made that shift, and 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 really. Delivered my message in a concise, specific way, and, and, and deliver it in a, in a very direct manner. But you know that all comes with, with, with the belief internally, knowing that you know that, that this is how it needs to be done if I want to get results. And I finally made that commitment. That shift mentally then just projected out into those oh. phone calls to those realtors. But at the same time, you know you're, you've got to go through the filter. I mean, you've got to screen. But at the same time, you, you go out and deliver a message like that with some purpose and some intent. And you have that context in there. I mean, people respond. And yeah, absolutely. I've got I've got a handful of agents right now that are that are bringing me stuff, you know, left and right. However, you know, still we're we're still tweaking, we're still learning, we're still figuring each other out. But at the same time, they're they're working absolutely. So, talk to me a little bit about your business now. You're actually out there wholesaling a lot. You know, I know you're doing a lot of deals now. Doing, you know, I don't know how many a week or anything like that. But kind of give me give us a little bit of an update. Yeah, um, I'm actually looking at my board here right now. Um, as of right now, I've got, you know, let's see, I've got five pending right now. Um, I've got three properties looking to close here in the next uh, two weeks. Each are going to net, I mean, of those three, um, wholesaling off, already got end buyers, which I found through the through the uh, Fine Cash Buyers Now system. Um, on, those, on those three, the, each one of those are going to average about a, about a ten to eleven thousand dollar net for me on a wholesale. So yeah, about three weeks, you know, two to three weeks, I should have a, about a thirty thousand dollar payday. So August is looking to be a pretty good, pretty good month. And then uh, yeah, I've got two others I'm, I'm in negotiations with, and just just look, I did another marketing campaign launch launched here last week. So I'm at, you know, phones are gonna be ringing again. And, you know, this, so this so what, are, what are the systems that you're that you're actively using? It's cash buyers and, and uh, motivated sellers. Yeah, fine motor, fine motivated sellers. Now, um, you know, I've been really, been really persistent uh, and and aggressive working working the fine motivated sellers now system. Um, anything it, specific in, in the fine motivated sellers that you would, you know you'd want to share? Anything a little tweak or anything? Or are you just going straight out? You know. Oh man, I you know I <laughs> I was tweaking it earlier, and then and then uh, after somebody told me to to just click the button and just start mailing. You know, so I, I started doing that, and you know, took again, removed myself from it, and uh, so no, man, I'm just using the systems. I'm, I'm using the letters in the system. Um, you know, the only difference is I've got somebody here that that'll, that'll that, that sends them out for me, but it's that's all automated. Perfect. So no, I mean, I'm not, I'm not doing anything. I'm, 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 I'm making it as simple as possible. <laughs> I mean, it, 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 it's, it's, it, it's, it's pretty foolproof and, and, and simple, stupid. So. All right, so let's talk about um, let's talk real quick, and then I'm gonna let you go. Um, what let's talk about what I think is a huge deal, and I know that that in your world it, it's now become a really huge deal. You you touched on it at the beginning, the why. One of the biggest things that, that we talk about because because you know for everybody that's watching here, guys, the, the reality of it is is there are thousands of people that can teach you how to go off and wholesale properties or flip properties. I mean, hell, Dan can teach you, I can teach you. There's a million of us out there that can teach you how to do this. Technically, how to do that is not difficult. Um, it's something quite different when you build a business uh, with the end in mind and when you kind of reframe everything, restructure everything and do it with a purpose, do it with intention that isn't necessarily around money. It's more about 
what really matters to you. In other words, creating the desired outcome, building a business that's designed to serve you from the very beginning. As Dan alluded to, that's a that's a, a, a pretty difficult shift for most people, but I can tell you it's certainly worthwhile and it is a necessary shift because, guys, you know, as the, as the any of you that have ever followed me for any length of time, you know that our saying around here is the time is now, right? This ain't practice. You got one shot at this thing. And to sit around and screw around and go build something that you don't even recognize or that, that has ultimately backed you into a corner where you become a slave to your business and it's not really what you want, it's just silly and, and, and reckless, right? So when, when we work together and you know, we get together in our masterminds and Dan and I in our group you know, is part of this group, we all get together, we talk about this kind of stuff, it's all about um, how do you design a life? How do you... You know, design a business that actually matters and does what you want it to do and takes advantage of the precious moments that you have left, right? Um, and so with all that being said, I know that, Dan, one of the things we talked about is one of your first deals. We wanted to, You wanted to really um, celebrate a win, right? I mean, it was a big deal. Absolutely. So tell, them yeah. a little bit, tell them a little bit about that. Okay. Yeah, for me, you know, I... You know, my my why was really about you know, getting get to spend, create those memories, create those moments with with my family. I've got a, I've got a young family. Uh, I got a five year old daughter and a two year old son. Um, so I, I remember we, when we were down uh, in our mastermind. I remember sitting there and I I, I just I just had this my, this deal tied up right before I came down to see you. Um, it was it was the first one I got tied up since 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 we had hooked up and. You know, I, I remember sitting in your office, and we had, I had, it, it was such a great deal that I had a couple of different ways that I could go with it, and I was really struggling with that because from, from a buy and hold strategy, it was very, you know, it made a lot of sense, and it was it had a lot of equity and cash flow and this and that. But on the, on the other hand, it had a lot of equity where I could turn around and sell it and make a good chunk of change right away, which I was debating because you know a good infusion of capital into my business, and I was just thinking numbers and, and business and this and that. Yeah, so I don't really know what to do. And then and I remember you sitting on the couch and you were sitting just like you were right now. You were sitting like this and you just go, I'll tell you what, this is what you're going to do. Go out and celebrate this and, and, and do something. Go create a memory. And I instant, instantly thought, like, you're right. I need to go because I, because me personally, I, and as you know, I'm, I'm pretty passive. I'm pretty even keel and, I, and I, it's hard for me to really get excited about stuff at the same time. I don't really, really get down either. I kind of I just keep it even keel and go with it. Um, and I remember what you said was, go, go do something, go take your daughter on a trip, go take her on a plane, I mean, do something with her, create an experience or with your family. And he goes, once you see that reaction, that'll change your, your, your perception on why you do what you do. Because watching her reaction in this will, will, will just set you off. And so, uh, about three weeks ago, uh, my daughter and I got on a plane and flew down to San Diego and. And we uh, drove up to Legoland and spent all day at Legoland cruising around there and all the rides and just and just really did the VIP treatment and you know and spent a, spent you know two or three nights on the ocean and just watching her run run around the beach running the water splashing the water going on the rides man it, it melted my heart and I, I'm you know I'm just thinking about it now it kind of almost wells me up but it absolutely changed my perception on. On one, create, being able to keep creating those moments, but at the same time coming back to my business and looking at it and going, this is why I'm doing what I'm doing, to go do that more often. So it was, yeah, it was, I'll, I'll remember that for the rest of my life. And, I, and I've got you to thank for that. Dude, that's the good stuff, man. And that's what I wanted, that's what I wanted people to, to I, I can't even tell you how proud I am of you. I mean, it's, it's like I said, from the very beginning, dude, it's, a, it's an honor to, that, that I get to call you a friend. Uh, I say that, you know, I, I'm, I'm really selective about the people that we allow into my, my world and SEMA's world and, and um, you know, the people that we invite into those masterminds and, and that work with us one-on-one -on -one because as I told you from the very beginning, I, was, you know, I told you day one that, dude, you know, people have a tendency to become part of my family, friends, right? And I'm, I'm, I'm truly honored that, that to, to call you a friend, dude. You've made us proud. You're out there just busting your ass. You're actually creating impact. You're, you're really, um, dude, you're doing it, man. So I appreciate you doing this with me as well because I wanted to get uh, you out in front of the, you know, our peeps that are all over the world. Share the story, share the experience, share all this knowledge, and, and let them know that that this stuff's real. 
if people will get out of their own way um, and allow themselves, kind of like what you just said, you know, kind of surrender to the process a little bit here, um, we have the knowledge, we have the training, we certainly have the experience. We've done it, you know, I'm not going to tell you we've always been successful. We've actually, you know, failed at this enough times that we actually know what to do and what not to, not to do. And we have the systems, right? And between all that, I mean, it's all kind of a good marriage and, and, and it works for the right people. And, um, you know, more times than not, people take this and they run with it and they, and they have a ton of ton of success with it. So I'm going to let you have the last word. Is there anything you want to leave them with? Yeah, you know, it, it, you know it's, it, it's, it's absolutely an honor just to, you know, to, to help. I mean, this is, if any way I can help you, you know, if this is, if this is it, man, I, I, I'm more than happy to do it. I'll, I'll do it more and more because cause what, you, what you've done, how, how you've impacted my life, and how you can enrich my life. I mean, I, I can't, I can't thank you enough. So I, so I just wanted to, you know, my, extend my appreciation to you. I know my, my family appreciates it. Um, but to everybody, you know, else out there, you know, it's as investors, as, as business people, you know, we're, we're inundated on a daily basis with all with the new fad, with 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 new things, new techniques, new new strategies, new teachings, new new guy in the block, the, the quote unquote guru. Um, it's that's gonna give you a magic wand and 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 instant, instantaneously make you millions and millions of dollars. And I, I think you know there, there's people out there that have probably gone through the rigmarole of of all of that and potentially have been burned by it um, because you find out that it's not all what it's cracked up to be. You know, and I've been very selective about that. I've been very cautious about that. But with that being said, when I joined up with you and your team and your company. You know, I, I knew that when I stepped in, I was getting you, um, and it's, I mean, it's as, you know, it's as delivered, it's as promised. I mean, it, it's, it, it's been, as, I mean, it, it's been over and above what I've, what I've expected. I mean, you, yeah, how do you operate, how do you do things? It's genuine, it's, it's above, I mean, it's straight, straight and narrow, it's, it's right in your face, and that's, as, as, a, as a business person, as an entrepreneur, that's all I can ask for, is somebody that's just going to look me in the face kick me in the butt if I, if I need to and say, you know, get your ass going, you know, you're not doing this right, or here's what you need to do, you know, it, it's, it's the whole package, man. So if, if you guys are looking on the fence and looking to get in with somebody that's going to help you with your business, this is your man right here. Dude, I appreciate it. So guys, thank you very much. We're going to do, uh, we're going to try to do more of these on a regular basis, let you kind of meet uh, the people out there that are you know, just like us, they're out there doing deals every day. It's one thing to hear it from me. It's a whole other thing to hear it from people that are all over the country. Uh, and so stay tuned for more and more of these. And with that, we are going to sign out. If you need anything, uh, don't ever hesitate to call our office at 888-411-1705, extension 703 for customer support. Anybody there will be happy to help you with anything. Or you can also go to kentclothier.com and just hit the support tab and uh, anybody will be willing to help you there as well. So again, thanks for staying tuned. Thanks for uh, tuning in, I should say, and we'll talk soon. Take care.